Congratulations to Caitlin Clark's haters. Y'all officially destroyed her. Unfortunately, Caitlin Clark and the Indiana Fever, they've been eliminated from the playoffs. Shout out to the Connecticut Sun. Shout out to one of Caitlin Clark's biggest haters, Dejanae Carrington. She did a great job, you know, hating on Caitlin Clark, poking her eyes out. She did what she had to do. She's a part of the Caitlin Clark hate club. But again, unfortunately, Indiana Fever eliminated. I'm not going to be watching the WNBA playoffs. I may catch some highlights here and there, but I was only watching the WNBA for Caitlin Clark. Caitlin Clark got a taste of playoff basketball, so hopefully she can make some smarter decisions, turning the ball over, shooting some random shots. She has a lot of potential, but a lot of work to do, a lot of growing up to do on that court, complaining to the referees. She's like Luka Doncic out there, man. Just play ball. The players on the opposing team, they're not going to respect you. You're not going to get the certain foul calls that you want, Caitlin Clark. So you just got to play ball, get a little tougher out there, get stronger out there. Mentally, I think she did a lot of growing up, but she has ways to go. But she definitely saved the WNBA this season and moving forward. Even though all the people are hating on Caitlin Clark, talking junk about her. She's making more money than you off the court. She's doing a lot of great things, commercials social media. She's really blowing up right now. A lot of players, they don't see it that way. They're just envious. They're jealous. They want the money Caitlin Clark has. They want the attention that she has. Even Caitlin Clark haters on ESPN, Monica McNutt, Molly Kiram, Andrea Carter. She got some haters not only on the court in the WNBA, but on those major platforms. So I know everyone's celebrating. They're happy. They're going to play it cool and corporate. They're going to shout out Caitlin Clark, repost her on social media. You did a great job from Iowa to your first season in the W. Cool, but behind the scenes, people are happy right now. They hired Dejanae Carrington to poke her eyes out. Let's just be real about that. But all jokes aside, man, look, people going to hate. That's the moral of the story right now. The haters won. Caitlin Clark lost. But she's going to come back stronger than ever next season. I think she's going to have a solid season. Again, limit those turnovers, shoot better three-pointers. I know she likes to be random and spontaneous from behind the three, but if she can just clean up those silly mistakes, she can average anywhere between 25 and 30 points per game, and she can be the MVP of next season. We're going to see what happens moving forward next season with the Indiana Fever. Hopefully the Fever can surround Caitlin Clark with some better players. I forgot the one chick on the team, but she was doing good. They're going to have to add a lot more players. Not sure who they're going to add. Don't really follow the game too much. I'm sure there's some talented females out there that can help Caitlin Clark get to the next level, get out that first round, and hopefully win a championship next season. Like, subscribe, comment. What do you think about Caitlin Clark being eliminated from the playoffs? I want to know your thoughts about this. Like, subscribe, comment. Peace.